Uh, good morning, everyone. I thought with um, the game coming out tomorrow, this Hockey Blast session might come to an end here for Hockey Blast week. So I was trying to think of something super interesting to do. Uh, I thought I'd come up with next year, I believe next September, they're going to have another uh, Canada Cup, August, September. Well, they take all the best teams in the world and they put them together. So I thought I'd put together a USA Team Canada tournament, probably the two best teams in the world, though the Swedes and the Russians and the Finns are all quality hockey teams. Played a quick game last night, and the Tichuk brothers stand on their head. Uh, Matthew and Brady each score, and the United States beats Canada 3-0. So I thought I'd play game two today. Uh, Canadians have a good team. Their goaltending was probably the hardest um, thing to do to pick from. I went with uh, Mark andre Fleury in Game 1. Going to go with Carter Hart here in Game 2. Uh, the Americans are loaded in that with Thatcher Demko and Connor Hellebuck. Um, I went with Connor Hellebuck in Game 1 and he'll get to play Game 2. So let's just see how this pans out. Super fun. Uh, quite enjoy this game. It's quick, fast, easy. You get a little bit of realism. So it's, uh, yeah, I just I love this game. So uh, let's get at her. So we have a four and a four and a six. I could get to go anywhere. So uh, we want to make sure they have all those five qualities. And Matthews does. And my roll, I rolled this initially. It was a four looking for a hit. Uh, Matthews doesn't have it. And Makar doesn't have it. So we're just going to check that off. And you check the qualities whenever you have two, four, and five. On a six, you're going to go to a special scoring chart. On a one, you're going to go to a special scoring chart for the visitors. Six is the home. And three, you're going to do a penalty check. Uh, next roll. Uh, we have a two when we are checking player number three against a six. So anybody I want. And we're looking for skill, power, smart, star. You want to try and match them up. <laughs> We'll go with Matthew Tichuk, and I rolled the other dice as I as I went. It was a five, so we're looking for smart, and they both have it, so we check it off. So it's a Chuk and Crosby. Uh, we'll get moved. <clears throat> Next roll is we have a home scoring chance. So the United States has a chance on a 63. Home defense makes a stop, breakaway chance. Visitor goalie must make a play save. And I rolled the yellow die when I uh, did these initially, and it is a four, so it is going to be a goal for the United States. Probably should roll it later, create a little bit more drama. And for the United States, number 10, it is going to be the third best sh shooting person. So we have one, two. It's got to be Brady to Chuk again. Puts it in for the United States, and they take a one to nothing lead. That's Brady's second goal in two games in this tournament. And next roll, we have a visitor scoring chance. Number 12 for Canada. Home goalie must make a play save. I didn't roll the, the die. Play save one to three for Hellebuck, and Hellebuck will make the big stop. So we didn't use anybody, so... Will not rotate. Uh, here's the roll. We have a four looking for anybody on Canada. Probably McKinnon looks like he's got the best card. And number five, Quinn Hughes. And the trait we're looking for is a one, which is speed. And they both have it. In fact, Quinn Hughes might be the best skater in the NHL. I get to watch him every game, and he is amazing with his feet. Uh, next one. We have a one, or, or sorry, we have a two and double sixes. So probably just take the best player out here. Let's go with uh, Josh Morris. He's got a ton of traits for the United States. Probably Jack Hughes. And the trait we're looking for is number two, which is skill. Hughes has it, and so does Morrissey. So we're into the second period. It's still one to nothing for the United States. As we continue here. And we have a home scoring chance, number 63. 63 reads, def 
home defense makes a stop, breakaway chance, visitor goalie must make a play save. So Carter Hart being called on to make that play save, and he will make the play save. So Carter Hart with a big stop. And we didn't use anybody's traits, so we're just going to continue. Uh, number four, we're going to be comparing Steven Stamkos against JT Miller. Miller having an outstanding year, top 10 in scoring this year for Vancouver. And we're looking for star. Stamkos is a star, so is JT Miller. So again, we got nothing across the board. Very tight checking game. The last time these two teams played were maybe... 2010 i can think of in the olympics very tight game in overtime oops wrong die there um uh check in a two against a three and a six uh probably gonna go speed skill yeah let's use austin matthews and the die is a one we're looking for speed point has it so does matthews after two periods the united states leads canada one to nothing um and here we go final period of play we have a home visitor scoring chance number 13 home goalie must make a play save so connor hellebuck's got to make a play save one to three it is a two he does make that big stop uh Going on to the next time sequence, it's a four. Looking at player number one, who's got more trades? Probably Mitch Marner here going against Brady Tichuk. And the trait we're looking for is three, which is power, and they both have it. So the Americans still hanging on to their one to nothing lead. We are halfway through the third period. Can the United States, this is a future uh, World Cup, probably looking at 2024. We have player number five, Drew Doughty, going against Jake Gensel. It's fun picking these teams, too, by the way. So it's a penalty check. 0.5, 0.5, nothing happens. We have one time segment left. And you guys, too, can pick your own teams and put them out there. Uh, here comes the... Checking on two and Brad Marchand and Charlie McAvoy. Last chance for Canada, possibly. Number three, we're looking for power. McAvoy has it, Marchand does not. So chance to score for the United States. Carter Hart, one to three on the save. It's a five and the Americans are going to score. That will end the hockey game. I was even going to pull the goalie for Canada. They have a chart for an empty net one. Let's see who scores this one. Number eight, second best shot rating here. So Jack Hughes is one. Kyle Connor is going to get the second goal for the United States. So he will pick it up. Uh, let's just do assists while we're sitting here at the end of the video. Um, and I use my little chart. So three means unassisted. Five of six is one assist. So there is only one assist. And... I guess I could use the score finding chart find assist too, but I'm going to give it to the guy at the most. And yeah, it's got to go to Adam Fox. He's an elite playmaker. And that's the end of this one, folks. It is 2 nothing for the United States. This was the 2024 Canada Cup uh, tournament that's coming up in the future. We took all the stars from Canada and the United States and came up with a team. I know John Bergeron is doing a... Um, um, a tournament coming up here pretty quick. He was looking through the teams and pick. Part of the fun is just picking the teams themselves. Uh, so the Americans win it in a best of three, two straight games. And this is Hockey Blast Express. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Uh, talk to you later.